Saturday, December 3rd. And I just woke up. I didn't make the bed though. Oh, we're in the car now. I don't know why I always announce that. No, you don't. Your curls look great. Um, we're on, we had to pick up some baseball cards from my aunt's house. And now we're going to my mom's house to- a ton of baseball cards. Yeah, like our whole trunk is full. It's probably like a, it's not like 800 pounds of baseball cards. Um, and we're gonna go to my mom's house and my brother and Daniel are gonna look through those cards while my mom and I, I'm sure, play with the nephews. We'll probably eat something. Um, and then we need to go to the grocery store. We have like some random things that we're out of. And I kind of want to go back to Ulta because one, I want to see if they actually have the four in one thing that I needed. Uh, if you didn't watch yesterday's vlog, go watch that. So you know what I'm talking about. Um, and then two, the contour stick that I bought is too light for me. Like it matches my foundation. I guess it's for someone very fair because I feel like right now I'm pretty light. Um, I don't have any sun or anything, but it's like completely matched my foundation. I used what was left of my old contour stick. So that's the scoop. Are you excited to go through the baseball cards? Kind of. I mean, it's going to be a lot of work. Oh, because you have to look up each individual one? Yeah, and there's so many of them. Hmm. I don't know what that's going to do. But... I'm sure it'll be fun, but it'll be like a few Saturdays activity, right? Yeah, maybe we could just keep them at your mom's house or something. I'm sure she wouldn't care. Yeah. I see. Or we could put them in Jake's trunk. Hmm. He, my, that's a joke. My brother just always has like he uh my brother does reselling like daniel does and uh my brother should i air this out on the internet well it's okay he did it he doesn't anymore but he used to keep his inventory in his trunk i thought that was funny hey guys we are why is this out of focus there we go um we're back home now daniel is letting the dogs out um and we haven't gone to the store or anything we we're just at my mom's with my brother and nephews literally most of the day. Um, and we're gonna hang out at home, maybe definitely make something to eat. I ate a lot of like snacks at my mom's house. My mom usually has like full, the door opens when like another door opens. You guys know like the, what is that? Like the wind or something? I don't know. Anyways, mom usually has like full meals for us and stuff. Um, she always goes over the top, but um, today we just like ate snacks, so I feel like I need actual food. Um, oh, is that for me? Oh, thank you. I got a little tank top I'll show you guys. Um, but yeah, so we're gonna eat something and I'll do a little unboxing real quick. Dana's holding the camera for me. Um, I wanted to show you guys this. I thought my other package was in here, but it's in my closet, so I'll show you guys later. The lighting's not the best, but. Sorry. It's even worse when I hold it myself. So, anyways, this is from Molly Green. Um, and I found out about Molly Green from all the times that we have visited Nashville. You guys know that we do little day trips all the time. Um, so, I followed them on Instagram. They followed me back. And uh, they just invited me to their ambassador program. Got this little tank top and a gift card. I'm going to pick some stuff out. But here's the tank top. Got it in like a little green color. I think it has, no, it doesn't. I thought it had like a built-in bra, but it green? it's supposed to be. It was like a oh. greenish on the website. It looks a little bit different. Yeah, it looks great. Yeah. Um, I wear stuff like this as a bra, but yeah, so got this. And then I'll show you guys what I got from Amazon later and whatever we end up eating. What do you think we're going to eat? I don't know. Maybe we'll make pizzas. I don't really want that, but I just I might like... make a, one of those vegan chicken sandwiches. I don't know, oh, did I you had... find out if you had buns? I have not looked yet. Okay. All right. The Two... dogs are uh, eating some cheese. Eating cheese because they're out of treats, which we're going to go to the grocery store in a little bit. So you guys will get to come along for that. It says good yeehaw energy on the back. Bye. Um, my mom got us this cool little movie night favorites box she got my brother and sister-in-law one as well and i thought it was a really cute little gift idea it has three skinny pop bags one milk dud twizzlers whoppers and kisses maybe we'll have a little movie night with it and i decided to have an amy's burrito which i had the other night i love those camera i think yeah let's go now. okay where are we going i think we're going to meyer Aren't we? Are we going, we're going to my uh, Are we going anywhere else? Mm, probably just my. 
Are you hungry? Our house is very dimly lit. Yeah, are you hungry? Uh, no, I'm not hungry. Because I got ham. Here's our little tree. Oh, yeah. And a little tiny guy. He's just as important. And some Christmas pillows. We just pulled up to Meyer. It's so cold. And I just want you guys to know that I actually keep my mittens, my gloves in a glove box. I think that's pretty impressive, don't you? <laughs> what? She didn't even realize that it was called a glove box. Yeah, until Daniel was like, you mean in the glove box? I don't think anybody keeps their gloves in a glove box. Well, though. they should. And I do. Guys, look at this cheese advent calendar. I feel like Cindy would really like this. Oh, it's 24 cheeses, but there's no price. It's sad, I don't know what it is. It's really cute. Okay, I know a lot of my followers are from my Weight Watchers video, which um, I can answer more questions about Weight Watchers whenever, but this is a really good brand. If you do Weight Watchers, or even if you're just interested in a healthier option, we've tried like all their stuff. They also have bagels now. Um, and Daniel really loves the dinner rolls. Are you gonna make chili? Yes. Because we could get some of those if you wanted that. Yeah, I do need to get some for my vegetarian chicken. Because veggie chicken sandwiches. Um, I was gonna see if the bagels are over here, but they're not. I don't see them. Here are the bagels. They're like, it's kind of a lot, but you know, what can you do? Also, they're And gross. then the bread. Yeah, the bagels are just kind of me. I don't think they're gross. I just don't think there's. You're expecting a bagel. They're very, very, very dry. But these are really good. Also, this was gone forever and now it's back. This is not healthy, so. But we like putting it on breakfast sandwiches. I've showed it before. These, we love these and they're always sold out, so we're getting two boxes. Do you remember how many points yes. they are on my Four points. Four points. Yes. So, really good, like, quick breakfast. I don't really care. Also, getting some of these because we didn't know that they were a thing. Oh, also, we don't just eat frozen food. We kind of go through like phases where we do eat more than normal, but pretty much everything we eat is Weight Watchers-ish friendly. Um, but for a while we were making everything, like I was cooking everything from scratch and it was just kind of a lot of work, you know? So uh, we just do like a couple meals a week frozen. Also grab some zero sugar lemonade and baby diet cokes. And I think we're gonna get some apple juice. When Daniel and I first started dating, we were talking about how much we love apple juice, and I was like, yeah, too bad it's like full of sugar. Or it has lots of sugar in it. And Daniel had no clue. But it's yeah. natural. It's, yeah, but it's, now now I'm like, I don't care because it's it's a hundred it's like like as long as it's a hundred percent. It's not juice. added sugar. Yeah. You there's some that have added sugar, but Yeah, but we just get the Yeah, so regular. I don't care. I wonder what that premium apple juice is like. Woo! <gasps> <gasps> We love the Amy soups. My favorite is the tortilla and it's only, the, I don't like that there's no grocery stores near me that carry like all of them. Um, so our Meyer doesn't carry the tortilla, but our Kroger does. Um, I normally get the Southwestern here, but I'm not seeing that either. But then you, yeah, then you were getting tortilla. Right, and I, did you just hear everything I said? No. <laughs> The tortilla is only carried at Kroger. Uh, I don't see the Southwest. The minestrone. Rats. I also grabbed some of these and these shredded hash browns, which I love making in the morning, just like eggs. And Daniel's getting stuff to make us some vegetarian chili per my request. I also don't see my, oh, I need some of my favorite taco sauce. This stuff is so good and sugar free. Now we're getting some canned vegetables, actually lentils, right? Um, we need pinto beans. We have the rest of the vegetables already at home. That's one thing I feel like we are always stocked up on vegetables and my goal here recently has been to eat all the canned vegetables that we have because like eventually that stuff's going to expire and uh, we'll stock up again after that but I've been very impressed with myself I was like very diligently choosing recipes that used up our canned vegetables and it was a nice little project for me also Daniel's been wanting the specific foods 
milk because it's what they use at um, Starbucks, right? Yeah, it is. I wonder if they're using vanilla mm. or original. I don't know, but I would like some of the oat milk. What do you think? Is original? Yeah, probably. And I wonder if you have to refrigerate it. Does up anybody or? know? I'm sure after you open it, but does anybody know what the difference is? Look at these, Daniel. Chocolate, chocolatey chip. Isn't that neat? What is it? I don't. Plant based Plant? milk. Okay. I wonder what you do with that. Zero added sugars. Interesting. Also getting some baby carrots because. Also, they don't have our vegan bacon here. So we're gonna have to go to Walmart tomorrow. This always happens. Okay, I'm gonna tell you guys about something that's gonna change your life. And a majority of you probably already know about this. And I like somewhat knew about it, but never really tried it. I know my mom gave it to me a few times, but then suddenly it clicked. Lactaid. I buy the off-brand and I take it before literally any dairy I have. It makes me feel so much better. I don't feel bloated. I don't have an upset stomach. It's just the best. And I also now take chromium with this. I take chromium anytime I'm gonna have anything sweet because I have a really hard time with sugar. Um, and it, I don't really understand what it does. My mom told me to research it because she wanted me to understand the things I'm taking and I have not done that yet, but I promise I will. Um, but it's amazing. So, I'm gonna get some of this fast acting this is the best and I highly recommend home now sorry my dishwasher's running so you can hear it um, I just put away all the groceries comment and tell me if you enjoy putting groceries away because I personally do I always tell Daniel I'm like step aside I have a method and it makes me happy organize everything by like what's going in the pantry what's going in the fridge what's going in the freezer separate it all throw away all the bags and then put it away I just love it. I can organize the fridge and the pantry however I want and it makes me happy. Um, but I'm gonna put on pajamas, wash my face, and probably eat a snack. I ate that burrito at like 4.30 I think. And it's nine o'clock, so it's like kind of weird. Um, but I've been getting a lot of questions about Weight Watchers. Do you still do Weight Watchers? Like, are you still happy with Weight Watchers, blah, blah. And um, I actually have saved a bunch of questions on Instagram. So I'm going to do a separate video like one year later. Kind of like my main video about Weight Watchers. Like a sit down thing. But I wanted to answer it briefly in this video. Because I know I'm going to get questions since um, I talked about Weight Watchers while grocery shopping. Um, and basically the answer is it's kind of weird because with Weight Watchers it taught me so much that I feel like I'm going to be doing Weight Watchers for the rest of my life because of what it taught me there's no I, I can't unlearn it you know like I implemented these things into my diet and have seen such a huge difference in the way I feel I lost 40 plus pounds kept it off for like a year and a half now um so I it would just be crazy to stop doing everything that I've learned but um, the main reason that I don't track every single thing I eat anymore is because back in, let's see, last year, about, I want to say September, October maybe, um, it's whenever my Las Vegas trip is, you can go find the Las Vegas vlog. Um, when I see pictures from that trip and that video, all I can think about is how weak I felt. And that was... Um, I hadn't weighed myself, but when I got home, I ended up weighing myself and I was under 100 pounds. And that's clearly why I felt so weak. I'm 26 and I'm, well at the time I was 25 and I'm 5'2". So being under 100 pounds, like my doctor has told me to try my hardest to stay above 100. And um, I'm getting to the Weight Watchers thing, I promise. So anyways, that trip is kind of like when I was like, okay, I need to change something about Weight Watchers because I'm still losing weight and I need to switch to maintaining. So now I kind of, my house is filled with basically only Weight Watchers food so I can eat however much of it as I want to. And thanks to Weight Watchers, I've really learned how to stop when I'm full, um, how to only eat when I'm actually hungry and just like portion control basically. So I don't really feel like I'm restricting myself at all. 
and it just it's just like a great lifestyle so i will go back i will do a sit down video and go into detail and i have a, actually a lot of questions and i'll probably do one more round of asking questions so if you want to leave anything below um if you follow me on instagram i will also do like a question box here soon when i'm ready to film the video but just wanted to answer that i'm going to change and then i'll show you guys what i end up having as a little snack in my bedroom now you can hear the fan sorry um, i'm gonna have one of these little balance breaks i showed you guys at the at Meyer. it's just cashews cranberries i think cranberries yeah dried cranberries and then cheese and it already wants it here's a wedding photo of daniel and i i feel like a lot of you all haven't seen stuff like that we were just babies i was 20 and he was 21 i had just turned 20. such cutie pies and two freaking water bottles on my nightstand what do you guys think huh say hi camper can you guys help me in the vlog can you help me in the vlog all right we are going to rewatch wednesday like i told you guys we started rewatching it and eat my snack and then go to bed thank you guys so much for watching please subscribe if you haven't already follow me over on instagram i'm at truthfully charlie on instagram and tiktok and i'll see you guys tomorrow for day four of vlogmas